Hey y'all, we're back in the house. A lot more warm than we've been all morning. It's like 27 here and windy. So we did one yard sale where we froze. Then we did three estate sales and one thrift store. So we wanted to just get back and show you what we found today because it turned out to be a pretty productive day. Uh, just to start with, um, this is a Bugle Boy men's large jacket and it uh, got it for like I think five dollars and it's gonna go for about thirty and this is a vintage UT 1998 national championship shirt single stitch along with some others we have in here from UT and these will go for probably twenty five to thirty dollars we got this plane here for uh, two dollars vintage it'll go for ten same with the hand drill and then this set of Hall's Pottery Bowls, they were, uh, we got them for $5. So it might even go for $50. And then the ATT Pottery Ovenware here, $10. That will go for $25 to $30. This is something hilarious. Uh, it actually talks. Watch. Don't tap her in your throat. Everything you touch, she makes this sound. Like, let's see. I'm just warming up. See her mouth? It actually moves. Okay, let's get cooking. So it's vintage, weird, cool, fun. So I paid $5 for that. I will ask 20 plus. These albums here, little collections of Christmas carols, vintage top little cartoon Disney movies. These were all a dollar a piece. They'll go for about probably 10, eight to 10 a piece. This is a tennis bag. Um, it is made by High Core and it is in perfectly brand new condition. These I looked up on eBay, they go for $29. I paid $2 for this. Um, with the thermos here, same thing, about you know $2 and we'll ask $15 for it, for it. These little mason jar decorative things, a dollar, and we'll probably sell that for maybe 10. Everything I touch, Hello Kitty, everybody goes crazy over. This is an adorable little lamp, I got that at the thrift store for $3 and I'll ask $15 for that. This is a vintage Grand Prix 320 AM FM TV sound weather band radio that is very, very, I cannot find any comps on it except on YouTube where they're playing it and walking around with it. So I only paid like four, I think it was four or $5 for this and it will probably go for 30. This is Regent Cutlery set in great, great condition. Paid $5 for that too, and it'll go for around 30. These are golf, I learned this from one of the pickers on TV. I think it was NC Picker or, I'm not sure, Commonwealth, and they said that golf shoes are a real big thing. So these golf shoes, right now I paid $2, $2, $2. These are Adidas, and these are two. And then this is a Be Right brand. All these were $2 a piece and they will go for around $40 a pair. These are still have the tags. This little set here, canister set, is vintage. It doesn't have a brand. I paid $5 for it, but I have had luck, really good luck with vintage type canisters. I'll probably ask 20 for those. These are really like new, nice suede ankle boots for ladies. I paid $2 for them and I will ask 20. This is a Rawlings Youth baseball helmet. Um, I got it for $4 and online they're going for $16. This was a vintage book that just caught my eye. 33rd anniversary gun digest and I look online just now and these go for um, $30. It's actually in very good shape so I'm excited about that. Then the last thing I just want to show you is this RBM large leather, real leather, genuine leather jacket for men paid $5 for it and it goes for um, right now on eBay they're selling these for $99 this is a really really great buy excited about that so it made it worth getting frostbite so any okay that sums it up for today and what we found and we're excited to share it with y'all um, I have to admit I was you know a little cheating on Tim today because as you'll see on the video I fell in love with a horse at one of the estate sales so that was, you know, my true love. So anyway, I'm back with Tim now. And uh, just remember to like and subscribe. We appreciate any messages, any advice y'all can send. Have a wonderful day. Bye.